Run the following command to update your Arch Linux. After updating the system, install Jinx web server using this command. Start Jinx service and enable it to start at boot using this commands. To verify whether Jinx has started or not, run this command. To test Jinx, open your web browser and navigate to http colon slash slash localhost or http colon slash slash your IP address. You will be pleased with Jinx server test page. Run the following command to install MariaDB. You need to initialize the MariaDB data directory prior to starting the service. To do so, run this command. Then run the following commands to enable and start MariaDB service. You can verify whether MariaDB is running or not using this command. As you may know, it is recommended to set up a password for database root user. Run the following command to set up MariaDB root user password. MariaDB has been installed and ready to use. To install PHP in Arch Linux, run this command. After PHP is installed, we need to tell Jinx to run PHP using PHP FPM. To do so, edit Jinx.conf file. Find the following section and add or modify it. Save and close the file. Then, start and enable Jinx service using this commands. Now create a test.php file in the webroot directory. Add the following lines then save and close the file.
Finally, restart and jinx service. Open up your web browser and navigate to http colon slash slash your IP address slash test.php or http colon slash slash localhost slash test.php. PHP MyAdmin is a graphical MySQL or MariaDB administration tool that can be used to create, edit, and delete databases. To install it, run this command. After installing, edit php.ini file. Make sure the following lines are uncommented. Save and close the file. Then edit Jinx configuration file. Find the following block. Just add a word index.php, then save and close the file. Then, create a symbolic link for PHP My Admin System Path to Jinx default root path using this command. Finally restart Jinx in PHP FPM services. Open your browser and navigate to http colon slash slash your IP address slash php my admin or http colon slash slash localhost slash php my admin. Please note that the letters M and A should be in capital letters in the URL. You should see the following like screen. Enter the MySQL or MariaDB root username and its password. If you find this video tutorial helpful, please share it on your social networks and support us. Thank you.